Hey guys, I'm Dr. Nhorshik. Today, I'm gonna to show you three quick shoulder warmups you can use to optimize your performance, whether you're deadlifting, squatting, benching, or performing any of the Olympic lifts. Get up and get down, get up and get down. All right guys, so you get to the gym and it's time to warm up your shoulders. Here's three simple exercises that you can use with any band to improve your shoulder stability, turn those muscles on to help optimize your performance whether you're doing any type of barbell lift in the gym. Now, what we're gonna use today to show this is a TheraBand. I'm also gonna show with most gyms will have a band like a Rogue Fitness Monster Loop. I'm gonna show you how to perform them on that also. But what we're gonna take you through is three simple exercises that you can do. Now, most of the time when we are performing any of the exercises that we want with barbell training, we wanna really emphasize the posterior shoulder and the muscles that attach to our back like our mid trap our low trap our rhomboids muscles that control our shoulder blades because often if we don't have those muscles primed efficiently we're not going to be moving as well as possible and we're not going to be performing as well as we can so here's what we're going to be doing the first one external rotation you're going to take a band elbow stay by the side pin your shoulder blade back and down as if you were to set up for a back squat, a bench, anything like that. From here, we're gonna externally rotate out to the side. Now here's the deal, you're not just moving, you're also holding. And this hold at the very end, this isometric contraction is gonna be very, very helpful at turning those shoulder muscles on in a way that's much more beneficial than just the motion of external rotation. So palms up or thumbs out to the side, this way or this way, you're gonna go out to the side, hold for five to 10 seconds, and then back. Now, not only is this gonna be working the muscles of the back of the shoulder, like your rotator cuff muscles, but it's also gonna be working your mid and your low trap muscles that attach to your shoulder blade. The next one that we're gonna do is horizontal abduction or just a lateral pull apart. So from right here, elbows are gonna be straight. You're gonna go out to the side, keeping those elbows completely straight the whole time. And again, hold for five to 10 seconds. Don't let those elbows bend. And then as you come back, right there. This is gonna be working specifically more of those mid back muscles, like your rhomboids and your mid trap, ones that are helpful with scapular retraction, setting those shoulders in a good position. Again, five to 10 seconds, and then back. And then the third one is going to be a cheerleader. You're gonna do this both different ways. Arms out in front, and you're going to go up and out at a diagonal, hold for a couple seconds, back down, switch sides. Up and out for a couple seconds. Make sure you're not shrugging on that side that's going up and then back down. Now this one specifically is really good because it's gonna work the body in ways very specific to overhead lifting as well. So let's say you're getting under the barbell because you're gonna do a jerk. We want those shoulder blades to be retracted, pulled back and in a good position. But then as you go over your head, in order to lift the barbell over your head, you need that shoulder blade to pull up slightly. So that's upward rotation in poster pelvic tilt or poster tilt of the shoulder blade in order to allow that humerus to get all the way above the head without things smashing together. So when you are going up and out, you're going to allow that shoulder blade to pull out to the side. We're not excessively shrugging, but we're holding it in that position for a couple seconds while we're retracting on this side and then back. Again, other side, the elbow's straight, not shrugging, five second hold or so, and then back down. Something like this, I will be doing 10 reps of each one of those. You should be able to get through this shoulder warm up in just a couple minutes and you're ready to go. Now, let's say you don't have a band like TheraBand at your gym. A lot of gyms will have these bigger monster loop bands. Here's one from Rogue Fitness. Again, we're about the uh, inch diameter, so it does not need to be a very thick one. Something like this, you're not gonna get as much motion, but we can still perform the heavy isometric at the end. So from here, you're gonna externally rotate, and again, five to 10 second hold. If you're holding this hard, those muscles are gonna be really turning on hard on the shoulder. You're gonna feel this burning pretty good, okay? Then you're gonna go out to the side. Now again, you don't have to go all the way till you hit your chest. Just go out to the side as far as you can while maintaining those elbows straight, feel those shoulder blades pulling together. You can then go up at the angle and then down the other way, okay? Again, you don't have to go all the way to hit your chest. The hold is key on these. So again, about 10 reps 
Each one of these, you wanna be doing about five to 10 second holds at the very end range. But after I went through all those, my shoulders feel like they're turned on, the muscles on the backside and on the lateral side of the shoulders are ready to go. And I'm going to be able to perform to my greatest potential. And as a side effect, decrease risk of injury for a lot of people, especially all my weightlifters, powerlifters, and crossfitters who are already very anterior dominant. This is gonna get those muscles primed up and ready to go. I hope you guys liked today's quick video. Try this out. Let me know in the comment section below whether or not this works for you. And if you have any other questions or things you'd like me uh, to go over in next week's video. Again, if you're enjoying the content that I'm putting out on Squat University YouTube, please subscribe to my channel, like this video, share it with your friends, and uh, see if we can help some other people out, prime their shoulders up to get ready to lift some big ass weight. Until next week, guys, happy squatting. They say that energy flows where attention goes so i pay no mind why waste my time with all these negative cats scratching so caught up in their egos these people have lost